Sergius with all his brotherhood in Christ, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this country, its president, for all civil authorities, and for the armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this holy habitation, for this village, for every city and countryside, and for the faithful dwelling in them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord of the fruits of the earth and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For travelers by land, by sea, and by air, for the sick and the suffering, for captives and their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That we may be delivered from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. on us and keep us, O oh God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. To Yes, it is. 
again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever-Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, O Lord. For thine is the might, and thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Flesh 
and be circumscribed, and in a soothing flesh. Thou hast also taken on thyself all its distinctive properties. Therefore we depict the likeness of thine outward form, venerating it with an honor that is relative. So we are exalted to the love of thee, and following the holy traditions handed down by the apostles, from thine icon we receive the grace of healing. From the morning watch until night, from the morning watch, let Israel hope in the Lord. As a precious adornment, the Church of Christ has received the venerable and holy icons of the Savior Christ, of God's Mother, and of all the saints, celebrating now the triumphant restoration. She is made bright with grace and splendor, and drives away all her heretics. With great rejoicing she gives glory unto God who loved mankind, and who for her sake has endured his voluntary passion. In the fourth dawn, for with the Lord there is mercy, and with him is plenteous redemption, and he shall redeem Israel from all his iniquities. <coughs> He, Archangel Gabriel, confirms the mystery hidden and unknown even to the angels, and he is now come to thee who alone art in corrupt, the complete turtle dove, the restoration of our race, and crieth out to thee, O Holy One, rejoice thee, thou made ready by my words, to receive in thy womb, God, the word. Praise the Lord, all ye nations. Praise him, all ye peoples. A splendid palace has been prepared for thee, O Master, the pure womb of the divine maiden. Come, thou, and enter therein. Have pity on thy creation, which in envy undertook to oppose thee. Is held in thrall to the deceiver and has lost its primal beauty, awaiting thy saving descent. For his mercy has prevailed over us, and the truth of the Lord endureth forever. The archangel Gabriel manifestly comes to thee, O all immaculate one, and crieth out to thee. Rejoice, the moment of the first restoration of the fallen. Rejoice, thou who alone has been chosen by God. Rejoice, chariot of the Son of Glory. Receive the incorporeal one, who desires to make his abode within thy Second tone, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The grace of truth has shone forth on us, the mysteries darkly prefigured in the times of old have now been openly fulfilled. For behold, the church is clothed in a purity that surpasses all things earthly through the icon of the incarnate Christ that was foreshadowed by the ark of testimony. This is the safeguard of the Orthodox faith. For if we hold fast to the icon of the Savior, whom we worship, we shall not go astray. Let all who do not share this faith be covered with shame, but we shall glory in the icon of the Word made flesh, which we venerate from worship not as an idol. So let us kiss it and with all the faithful cry aloud, O God, save thy people and bless thine inheritance. Now and ever the dog 
Automaticon in the first tone, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Let us praise the Virgin Mary, the gate of heaven, the glory of the world, the song of angels, the beauty of the faithful. She was born of man, yet gave birth to God. She was revealed as heaven, as the temple of the Godhead. She destroyed the wall of enmity. She commenced the peace, she opened the kingdom. Since she is our foundation of faith, our defender is the Lord whom she bore. Courage, courage, O people of God, for Christ will destroy our enemies, since he is all-powerful. Wisdom, stand upright. Sergius with all his brotherhood in Christ. 
President, for all civil authorities and for the armed forces. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again, we pray for the blessed and ever memorable holy Orthodox patriarchs and for the blessed and ever memorable founders of this holy habitation and for all our fathers and brethren, the Orthodox departed this life before us who here and in all the world lie asleep in the Lord. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, and visitation for the brotherhood of this holy monastery, for the seminarians, faculty, staff, alumni, pilgrims, and benefactors of this holy habitation and their families, and for the pardon and remission of their sins. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord. who bring offerings and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple for those who labor and those who sing and for all the people here present who await thy great and rich mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Thou and merciful God and of mankind and unto thee that we send the glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit now and ever and unto ages of ages. This evening without sin, blessed art thou, O Lord God of our fathers, and praise and glorify his thy name forever. Amen. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us as we have set our hope on thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Master, make me to understand thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Holy One, enlighten me with thy statutes. Thy mercy, O Lord, endure it forever. Despise not the works of thy hands. To thee is to praise, to thee is to song, to thee is to glory. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Let us complete our evening prayer unto the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. That the whole evening may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask of the Lord. Grant us, O Lord. An angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord. Grant us, O Lord. Pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. Grant us, O Lord. All things that are good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. Grant that we may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. A Christian ending to our life, painless, blameless, and peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, let us ask. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed, and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and each other in all our life unto Christ our God. Amen. Now, O good God, and let us be kind unto thee to we sing the glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Blessed and glorified be the man of thy kingdom, of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, 
now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. In the first form, we have been free from sufferings. We have been free from sufferings by thy suffering, O Christ. We have been delivered from corruption by thy resurrection. O Lord, glory to thee. The Lord is king, he is robed in majesty. Let creation rejoice, let the heavens be glad, let the nations clap their hands with gladness. For Christ our Savior has nailed our sins to the cross. Slain death, he has given life. He has resurrected, fallen Adam as the lover of man. For he hath made the world so sure that it shall not be moved. As he made of heaven and earth, thou wast voluntarily crucified in thy love for man. Salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face. 
face of all people, a light to enlighten the Gentiles, and the glory of thy people, Israel. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages.
baptism, and who thou ever approved for thee, O Lord, I will, thou will hear. O Lord, I am, for I said, for let my enemies never rejoice over me. For when my people shake shaken, they spoke boastful words against me. For I am ready for truth, and my people are seeking me before me. For I will prepare my decree, and be sorry for my sin. For my enemies live, and are stronger than I. And they that hate me, and thus they multiply. They render me evil for me, and have slandered me, because of the secretness. Forsaken now, the Lord my God, depart not from me, but tend with my help, the Lord of my salvation. Forsaken now, the Lord my God, depart not from me, but tend with my help, the Lord of my salvation. For God, my God, I keep walking to the mountain, my soul has thirsted for thee, all of my flesh long for thee, and a bear of my presence, the water is mine. So I have I appeared for thee in the sanctuary, to see what I found in the glory, for the verse of third night. My lips shall praise thee. Thus will I bless thee while I live. I will lift up my hands for thee. Let my soul be filled up with bear with that. And my mouth shall praise thee joyfully. And remember thee to follow them. As thou hast meditated upon me. For thou hast been my helper. And the shelter of thy wings will rejoice. My soul is pleased to speak. Thy right hand will have helped me. For they sought after my soul again. They shall go down to the lowest parts of you. They shall be, they shall be delivered up to the end of the world. They shall be bored portion for boxes, for the king shall rejoice in God, every one that swears by him shall be praised, for the mouth of them that speak of just things to stop. At God and his meditate on me, for thou hast been my helper, and the shelter of heaven for my words, my soul is due to thee, thy right hand is upon me. Glory to the Father, who sound us with us here, shall never come to me to be his son. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, God. For the mercy, for the mercy, for the mercy, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto you, to the age of heaven. O Lord, God, my salvation, I cry in the day and night before thee, that my terror come before thee, and find my grief, my supplication, for my soul is filled with evils, and my life is drawn nigh unto hell, and the counsel of them, I go down to the pit, I can become as a man that hell, free among them, like the slain that sleep in the grave, whom now will never snow more, and they are cast off from heaven, and they lay in the lower pit of dark places, in the shadow of death, that anger lays across my heart upon me, and that I have brought all my ways upon me, that has to be refined and taken to far from me, the aid and foundation of God, I have been delivered up, and I am not that poor, my eyes grew weak and hard me, I cried with thee, O Lord, all the day long, I have stretched and stopped my hands upon thee, for thou wert wondrous for them, for shall physicians raise them up, that they shall praise thee, shall anyone tell thy mercy to the person of grace, but that thou thy fruit and destruction, shall thy wonders be known in darkness, and thy righteousness in light of forgiveness, I have cried with unto thee, that I cried over thee. In the morning shall my prayer come before thee. Lord, as long as thou hast cast off my prayer, and turn to that face not away from me. I am bold and trust in my name, and out after I was exalted, I was humbled and stressed, and thy wrath had passed over me, and thy hairs were really troubling, and stood over me like water, all the day long, and they surrounded me together. And thou hast put far from me, friend and neighbor, and my acquaintance, and because of my misery, O Lord, God of my salvation, I pray day and night before thee. Let my prayer come before thee, and find thy ears for supplication. Bless the Lord of my soul, and all that's within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord of my soul, and give thou all the benefit, who forgives all thy iniquity, who heals all thy diseases, who redeems thy life and corruption, who comes to thee with mercy and compassion, who satisfies thy desire of good things, so that thy youth shall be the good of the people. Lord, excuse mercy and judgment for all them that are wrong. You may know the ways of Moses. Good will to the children of Israel, Lord, compassion and merciful long suffering and conscious and mercy, his wrath will not endure to him, neither will his living pain and endeavor. He has not to love with us, nor to our families, nor to our dust, nor to our sins. As high as heaven is low here, so the Lord has granted his mercy toward them that fear him. As far as he's in the west, so far as he's removed our nephews from us, as the Father of compassion has spoken, so the Lord has compassion upon them that fear him. For he knows our passions, he has remembered that we are from your dust. As for men, the days are blessed, as the flower of the field shall keep flourish, for the wind pass it over, and it shall be no more, and no wanderer shall they know the place thereof. But the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting and everlasting upon them that give them, and the righteousness which is given to them that keep his To them that keep his covenant, and remember his commandments of God, the Lord prepares his throne in the heaven, and his kingdom of rules over all. Bless the Lord, all you use in me, mighty and strength that do his word, hearken to the voice of his word. Bless the Lord, all ye his hosts, goodness, 
Master from you his will, bless the Lord of all his works, and every place of his dominion, bless the Lord of my soul, and every place of his dominion, bless the Lord of my soul. Hear our prayer, Lord, give ear to my supplication and my truth, hearken unto me in thy righteousness, and enter not into the judgment of thy servant, for in thy sight shall no man living be justified, for the enemy of first of my soul, he is humble over life to the earth. He set me in dark places, left always come down, for my spirit will keep his body within me. My heart has been in trouble, I heard her days of old, I've been tears of all my deeds, on the mercy that came to my body, I stretched forth my hand under thee, my soul thirsts for thee, like water was mine. Hear me speak, thee, Lord, and speak our skill. Turn not that day from me, lest we come like them, and go down to the pit. Cause me to hear thy mercy in the morning, for I call to thee, make go unto me, O Lord, the way where I should walk, for I have lifted up my soul to thee. Deliver me from my enemies, O Lord, I have pledged unto thee to correct me, teach me that will, for thou art my God. I can fear to guide me, the land of our brightness. Thou shalt praise me, O Lord, for my name's sake. Thou shalt bring my soul out of affliction and out of thy mercy. Thou wilt proclaim and praise my name, and thou wilt destroy all that I have. Thou wilt my soul, for I am thy servant. Hearken unto me in the righteousness, and enter not into the judgment of thy servant. Hearken unto me in the righteousness, and enter not into the judgment of thy servant. Thy good spirit shall guide me, the land of our brightness. Glory to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and shall never have to take the face of us. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to you, God. Salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the peace of the whole world, for the welfare of the holy churches of God, and for the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this holy house, and for those who enter it with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Our Metropolitan Tikhon for the honorable priesthood, the diaconate in Christ, and for all the clergy and the people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the right reverend abbot of this holy monastery, our commandrite Sergius, with all his brotherhood in Christ, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this country, its president, for all civil authorities, and for the armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have holy habitation for this village, for every city and countryside, and for the faithful dwelling in them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For seasonable weather, for abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For travelers by land, by sea, and by air, for the sick and the suffering, for captives and their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have that we may be delivered from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, fair Togos, and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and each other in all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, o Lord. Run to thee, our divine glory, I worship to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endures forever. The Lord is God, and has revealed himself to us. Blessed is he that comes All nations come to be bound about, but in the name of the Lord, the Lord is God. Oh. 
mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. The soldiers guarding thy tomb, O Savior, became as dead men because of the radiance of the angel who appeared before them proclaiming the resurrection to the women. We glorify thee, the destroyer of corruption, and we bow down before thee, our God, who has risen from the grave. Arise, O Lord my God, let thy hand be lifted up, forget not the poor forever. Nailed to the cross of thine own will and laid in the tomb as one dead, O compassionate bestower of life, by thy death, O mighty Lord, thou didst break the dominion of death. For the gatekeepers of Hades trembled before thee, and thou didst raise up with thyself the dead of ages past, in that thou alone who lovest mankind. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. We who with love flee to thy goodness all know thee to be the mother of God, who even after giving birth was truly shown to be a virgin. For thee do we sinners have as our intercession, and we have acquired thee who alone art most immaculate as our salvation amid perils. Praise the name of the Lord. Sorrow has come to an end. 
do not we but announce the resurrection to the apostles. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes, the women bearing sweet-smelling spices came to thy true Lord Savior, but they heard an angel say to them, Why do you now with the living one among the dead? Since he is God, he is risen from the tomb. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. We worship the Father with the Son and the Holy Spirit. The Holy Trinity, one in essence, and we cry out with the seraphim, Holy, holy, holy art thou, O Lord. Thou endeavor unto ages of ages, amen. O virgin who has borne the giver of life, thou hast delivered Adam from sin, and through Eve thou hast brought joy in place of sorrow. He who took flesh from me who is both God and man, has restored to life those who have fallen from it. Alleluia, 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 glory be to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory be to thee. and keep us, O oh God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever-Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, O Lord. Blessed is thy name and glorified is the Thy kingdom of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Sin 
glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. Oh, praise God in his sanctuary, praise him in the firmament of his power. Stand upright, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all, and to thy spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to time. Glory to thee, O Lord, glory to thee. Let us attend. The same day at evening, being the first day of the week, when the doors were shut, the disciples were assembled for the fear of the Jews. Came Jesus and stood in the midst and saith unto them, Peace be unto you. And when he had so said, he showed unto them his hands and his side. Then were the disciples glad when they saw the Lord. Then said Jesus to them again, Peace be unto you as my Father hath sent me, even so I send you. And when he had said this, he breathed on them and saith unto them, Receive ye the Holy Spirit. Whosoever sins ye remit, they all are remitted unto them. And whosoever sins ye retain, they are retained. But Thomas, one of the twelve, called Didymus, was not with them when Jesus came. The other disciples therefore said unto him, We have seen the Lord. But he said unto them, Except I shall see in his hands the print of the nails, and put my finger into the print of the nails, and thrust my hands into his side, I will not believe. And after eight days again the disciples were with him, and Thomas with them. Then came Jesus, the doors being shut, and stood in the midst and said, Peace be unto you. Then saith he to Thomas, Reach hither thy finger, and behold my hands, and reach hither thy hand, and thrust it into my side. And be not faithless, but believing. And Thomas answered and said unto him, My Lord and my God. Jesus saith unto him, Thomas, because thou hast seen me, thou hast believed. Blessed are they that have not seen and yet believed. And many other signs truly did Jesus do in the presence of his disciples, which are not written in this book. But these are written, that ye might believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of God and that believing ye might have life through his name. Glory to thee, O Lord, glory to thee. Having beheld the resurrection of Christ, let us worship the Holy Lord Jesus, this one. We venerate thy cross, O Christ, and we praise and glorify thy holy resurrection. For thou art our God, and we know no other than thee. We call on thy name, come, all ye faithful. Let us venerate Christ's holy resurrection. For behold, through the cross, joy is come into all the world. Let us ever bless the Lord, praising his resurrection. For by enduring the cross for 
O thou who in the beginning didst fashion me out of dust with thine all pure hands, thou didst stretch out thine arms upon the cross, calling forth from the earth my corrupted nature, which thou hast received from the Virgin. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Thou didst take on mortality for my sake and didst surrender thy soul unto death. O thou who by thy divine breath didst instill my soul within me. And having loosed the everlasting bonds, thou didst glorify it with incorruption, raising it up with thee. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Leaping up with joy, let us, let us and all the faithful cry aloud today, how marvelous are thy works, O Christ. How great is thy might. For thou hast made us of one mind and brought about our agreement. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. O people of God, come and let us celebrate a day of joy. The heaven now makes glad and earth with all the host of angels and the companies of mortal men. Each in their different orders keeps the feast. Most holy Theotoko, save us. With gladness doth the world rejoice, sensing the descent of the Lord upon thee. For he descendeth to make his abode in the womb of the Virgin, in the loving kindness of his mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. A lustrous and golden jar is prepared to receive the manna of life. For at the voice of the archangel he cometh upon thee, making his abode within thee supernaturally. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. The Lord who dwelleth ever in heaven desireth to make his abode in thy pure womb, for he cometh to make heavenly the nature of mortal men, wisely clothing himself therein. Thou alone knowest the infirmity of mortal nature, and yet in compassion has taken on its form, so gird me with power from on high, that I may pray to thee. Holy is the living temple of thine ineffable glory, all over of mankind. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. As the all-good God, thou hast taken pity on me who have fallen, and it being thy good pleasure to come down to me, thou hast by thy crucifixion raised me up to cry to thee. Holy is the Lord of glory, immutable in goodness. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. As an hypostatic life, O Christ, clothing thyself in me, who have become corrupt, in that thou art the God of loving kindness, and descending to my mortal dust, O Master, thou didst destroy the dominion of death, and having risen after three days of death, thou hast clothed me in incorruption. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. No longer now are the impious heretics exalted in their pride, for the power of God has firmly established orthodoxy. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Today, at the restoration of the faith, let the prophets sprinkle upon us life-giving dew from heaven. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O earth, so sadly choked with the thorns of the passions, dance thou, leaping up. For lo, the immortal husbandman now cometh, removing the curse from thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Be thou well adorned, O divine scroll, for by the finger of the Father will the divine word incarnate be written upon thee, annulling the transgression of my irrationality. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. O golden lamp, bear aloft the fire of the Godhead, which shineth forth for through thee, bestowing light upon the world, for thereby is the darkness of our evils broken. <clears throat> My church rejoices in thee, O Christ, and cries aloud, Thou art my strength, O Lord, my refuge and my firm foundation. Again and again, Glory. Jesus, pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Blessed and glorious Lady and the Glucose and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. Thy nativity, 
thine ineffable miracles and thy voluntary crucifixion. So the devils are driven out in fear and the heretics, their fellow workers, lament in shame and sorrow. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The heavenly Zion, our mother, is made beautiful with the holy icons of the prophets, the apostles and the martyrs, and of all the saints. And she is brightly adorned with the glory of the spiritual bridegroom and the bride, both now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Today all creation rejoiceth, for the angel crieth out to thee, Rejoice. O blessed Mary, all pure mother of Christ God, today the arrogance of the serpent is cast into darkness, for the bond of the forefathers' curse hath been broken. Wherefore we cry out to thee for all things. Rejoice, O joyous one. With eyes of foresight, Habakkuk perceived thee as a mountain overshadowed by divine grace, and foretold that the Holy One of Israel would come forth from thee for our salvation and refreshment. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord, who is this Savior arising from Eden, wearing a crown of thorns, his robe stained red, lifted up upon the tree. He is the Holy One of Israel, who has come for our salvation and restoration. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Behold, ye disobedient people, and be ashamed, for he who, whom ye madly asked Pilate to crucify as a malefactor has destroyed the power of death and risen as God from the tomb. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Through the divine descent of the Comforter, sanctify thy temple, and by his coming banish the error of heresy. O most merci merciful word of God. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Deliver thy people from the violence of impiety, and kindle them with zeal for orthodoxy as they cry aloud to thee in faith. Glory to thy power, O Lord. Most holy Theotokos, save us. The mystery appointed from of old before time be began, beginneth to be manifest, and the earth and the heavens rejoice together and joyously cry aloud. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Deliverer appeareth, setting aright the stumbling of our first mother, making his abode within the womb of her who kneweth not wedlock. To him let us cry out, glory to thy power, O Lord. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. Of old Habakkuk called thee the mountain overshadowed by the virtues from which our God desireth to manifest himself. O all immaculate virgin, thou only rest restoration of man. Though hast implied in the ends of the world by the brightness of thy coming, O Christ, and made them radiant by thy cross, enlightened with the light of thy divine knowledge, to all hearts of those who sing thy praise with bright beauty. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. The Jews put the great shepherd and Lord of the sheep to death by the tree of the cross, but the dead buried in Hades did he deliver like sheep from the dominion of death. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Having announced peace by thy cross and proclaimed forgiveness to those held captive, O my Savior, thou didst put to shame the enemy who had dominion as though he were naked, revealing his poverty by thy divine resurrection. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Firmly establish thy church, O Lord, that unto the ages of ages she may stand unshaken by the tempest of heresy. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. The rejoicing granted to the faithful from on high and the help they have received from God has shone with glory over all the earth. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O unblemished you, Lamb, our God, the Lamb, maketh haste to enter thy womb, taking away our offenses. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, ripening like a vineyard at the cry of the angel, O virgin, prepare thou to put forth a ripe and incorrupt cluster. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. Be glad, O Isaiah, thou greatest of the prophets, for the virgin of whom thou didst prophesy, conceived the angel of great counsel in her womb. The altar deep has surrounded us, there is none to deliver us. We are counted as sheep for the slaughter, save thy people, O our God, for thou art the strength of the weak and their restoration. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. We were grievously wounded by the transgression of the first created man, O Lord, but we have been healed by the wounds thou didst endure for us, O Christ. 
for thou art the strength and confirmation of the weak. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Thou hast led us out of Hades, O Lord, having slain the all-devouring monster and set his power at naught by thy might as God omnipotent, for thou art life, light, and resurrection. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Once more the master's countenance is depicted, honored with faith and venerated. Once more the church regains her boldness of approach to God, reverently glorifying the Savior. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. The church of Christ is delivered from the dark despondency of heresy. She puts on a robe of gladness and is clothed in the light of divine grace. Most holy Theotokos, save us. The archangel Gabriel proclaimeth to thee, Rejoice, for thou dost ineffably receive in thy womb the joy which Eve lost through her transgression, O Virgin. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Rejoice, O Virgin, thou mountain which Daniel foresaw in the Spirit. For from thee was the noetic stone cut, which shall demolish the inanimate temples of the demons. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. The King of Peace cometh unto thee, and through thee he shall re reconcile those who have been assailed and deceived by the wicked counsel of the serpent, O Mother of God. I will sacrifice to thee with a voice of praise, O Lord. The church cries out to thee, having been cleansed from the blood of demons, by the blood that through mercy flowed from thy side. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorate my most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and each other in all our life unto Christ our God. Savior of our souls, and unto thee do we sing of glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. No one could describe the word of the Father, but when he took flesh from the old Theotokos, he accepted to be described. And restore the fallen image to its former state by uniting it to divine beauty. We confess and proclaim our salvation in words and images. Enlightened by this mystery of God's providence, the divinely inspired prophets foretold it of old, and this they did for our sakes, who see the fulfillment of the ages. Receiving through this mystery divine knowledge, we know one Lord and God, glorified in three persons, and Him alone we worship. We have one faith, one baptism, and we are clothed in Christ. This our salvation we confess in deed and word, and we depict it in the holy icons. We the faithful contemplate thee as a spiritual furnace, holy for as he who is highly exalted saved the three youths, so in thy womb he refashioned my entire human nature. The God of our fathers, who is praised and glorified above all. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. The earth was afraid, the sun hid itself, the light grew dim. The veil of the temple was rent in twain, and the rocks split asunder. For the Son of Righteousness, the praised and all-glorious God of our fathers, hung upon the cross. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Of thine own will wast thou wounded among mortals as though helpless. O supremely exalted Lord, and with thy mighty hand thou didst grant freedom to all, raising us up with thyself, the praised and all-glorious God of our fathers. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Let the hosts of angels share in the joy of the church, and filled with the love of God, let them cry aloud. Blessed art thou, O Lord, in the temple of thy glory. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. The triumphant assembly and church of the firstborn rejoices as it now beholds the people of, our, of God cry aloud with one accord. Blessed art thou, O Lord, in the temple of thy glory. Most holy Theotokos, save us. O noetic tabernacle, which the true bestower of the law, loving, desireth to make his habitation, thou hast been filled with sweet fragrance, for through thee doth he renew those who have become corrupt. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, 
Fear not the voice, neither marvel at him who speaketh, for he is the servant of God. He hath come to reveal a mystery to thee, which is ineffable even to the angels, O blessed virgin, who knowest not wedlock. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. Thou beholdest all creation enslaved by the enemy, O virgin, but he whose good pleasure it is desireth through thee to have mercy upon it in the loving kindness of his mercy. Wherefore, discount not the words of the angel. In the furnace as in the smelter's fire, the Israelite youths be brighter than gold in the beauty of godliness. As they sing, bless the Lord, all ye works of the Lord, praise and exalt him above all throughout all ages. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord, O word of God, who by thy will dost create and refashion all things, transforming the shadow of death into everlasting life by thy sufferings. Thee do we, the works of the Lord, unceasingly praise and supremely exalt for all ages. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord. Thou didst destroy anguish and misery within the gates and strongholds of Hades, O Christ, by rising from the tomb on the third day. Thee do all thy works unceasingly praise and supremely exalt as Lord for all ages. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Keeping the laws of the church that we have received from the fathers, we paint icons of Christ and his saints, and with our lips and heart and will, we venerate them as we cry aloud, O all ye works of the Lord, bless ye the Lord. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. The honor and veneration that we show to the icon we ascribe to the prototype it represents, following the teaching of the saints inspired by God. And with faith we cry aloud to Christ, O all ye works of the Lord, bless ye the Lord. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Prepare thyself, O thou who knowest not wedlock, thou light cloud of the light. For the never setting sun shineth forth upon thee from on high, which hidden within thee for a time shall be revealed to the world and shall dispel the darkness of evil. Let us bless the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, the Lord. The transcended one who sitteth at the right hand of the Father desireth to make his habitation within thee, O pure one, that he might set thee, the beloved and comely one, at his own right hand like a queen, and extend his right hand to all the fallen and save us. Now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. The Lord, our Creator, recognizing thee as a pure rose of the valley, as a fragrant lily, hath now desired thy beauty, O pure one, and wishes to become incarnate of thy blood, that with goodness he may dispel the stench of deception. We praise, bless, and worship the Lord, singing and exalting him throughout all ages. Daniel, stretching out his hands, of the mouth of the lions in the den, while the youth, the lovers of true piety, girded with virtue, quench the power of the fire as they cried aloud, all ye words of the Lord, bless the Lord. O God, to the mother of the light, let us magnify in song. My soul magnifies the Lord, and my spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the Word. True Theotokos we magnify thee. For he has regarded the low estate of his handmaiden. For behold, henceforth all generations will call me blessed. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the Word. True Theotokos we magnify thee. For he who is mighty has done great things for me, and for me is his name. And his mercy is on those who fear him from generation to generation. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest but to God the word, truth thou talkest, we magnify thee. He has 
Special strength with his arm, he has scattered the proud in the imagination of their hearts. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the Word. Truth they all talk, most we magnify thee. He has put down the mighty from their thrones and exalted those of low degree. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent up to your way. More honorable than the cherubim and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the word. Truth they are told, most we magnify thee. He has helped his servant Israel in remembrance of his mercy, as he spoke to our fathers, to Abraham, and to his posterity forever. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the word, truth they all talk, most we magnify. To thy holy re resurrection, O Lord, how have the wicked and disobedient people plotting evils justified a proud and ungodly man, yet condemned to the tree the righteous Lord of glory, whom we magnify as his meat. Glory to thy holy resurrection, O Lord, O Savior, thou unblemished Lamb, who takest away the sins of the world, thee, thou, thee who hast risen on the third day, do we glorify with the Father and the Divine Spirit, and with orthodox theology we magnify the Lord of glory. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. Seeing the Holy Church once more adorned with icons, let us make haste and with reverence cry aloud to Christ. We magnify thee, O thrice holy. Glory to thee, our God, glory to thee. As a mark of glory and honor, the Church possesses thy cross and the holy icons of the saints, O Master, and with joy and gladness she magnifies thee. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Eve laid hold of the fruit which resulted in all destroying death. But in the midst of thee, O Mistress, the mediating fruit of immortality groweth, Christ our sweetness, and chanting to him we glorify thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O pure one, thou unsown field, receive at the angel's word the word of heaven, who springeth forth from thee like fruitful wheat, and nourisheth the ends of the earth with the grain of understanding. Worshiping him, we glorify thee. Now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Christ desired thy beauty, O all immaculate one, and made his abode within thy womb, that he might deliver the human race from the ugliness of the passions, and bestow upon it its ancient comeliness. Worshiping him, we glorify thee. A stone not cut by human hand was cut from thee, O legend, the mountain hewn, to be the head of the corner. Even Christ to join together the separated natures. Therefore, with joy of Theotokos, we magnify thee. Again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. Help. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and each other and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, O Lord. All the powers of heaven praise thee, and to thee we sing of glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages.
is our God. Master, filling the apostles with the all Holy Spirit, breathing thy peace upon them and declaring that they had the power to bind and to loose sins. Then after eight days thou didst show thy side and hands to Thomas, and with him we cry, Thou art my Lord and my God. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Leap for joy and clap your hands with gladness, sing and cry aloud, How strange and wonderful are thy works, O Christ! And who can tell of all thy mighty acts, O Savior, who hast united us in harmony and concord within one church, now and ever and unto ages of ages, amen. Flying down from on high, Gabriel cried out, Rejoice, O Theotokos, for he who sprang forth from thee blessed the children of Adam, annulling the whole curse of our first mother. In the first tone, let every breath praise the Lord. Let every breath praise the Lord, praise the Lord from the heavens, praise Him in the highest, to Thee, O God, is to us all. Praise Him, all ye angels of His, praise Him, all His hosts, to Thee, O God, is to us him with timbrel and dance, praise him with strings and pipe. We praise thy saving passion, O Christ, and glorify thy resurrection. Praise him with tuneful cymbals, praise him with loud clashing cymbals, let every breath praise the Lord. Fourth tone, I will praise thee, O Lord, with my whole heart. I will speak of all thy marvelous works. O Lord, who lovest mankind, the church rejoices now in thee, her bridegroom and her founder. For by thy divine will thou hast delivered her from the error of idolatry, and by thy precious blood thou hast over to thyself. With joy she accepts the holy restoration of the icons, and with faith she sings and prays of thee and gives thee glory. I will be glad and rejoice in thee. I will sing to thy name, O Most High. Restoring to the churches the representations of thy flesh, O Lord. We ascribe to them an honor that is relative, and so express the great mystery of thy dispensation. For thou hast not appeared to us, O loving Lord, merely in outward semblance as say the followers of man, who are enemies of God, but in the full and true reality of the flesh, and so the icons that depict thy flesh lead us to the desire and love of thee. Glory in the sixth tone, glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Moses, in the season of abstinence, received the law and proclaimed it to the people. Elijah by fasting closed the heavens, and the three children of Abraham, through fasting overcame the lawless tyrant. Count us also worthy, O Christ, through fasting to attain the feast of thy resurrection, as we cry aloud, Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Second tone, now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. Most blessed art thou, O Virgin Theotokos, for through him who became incarnate of thee, has thou been captured and had been recalled. The curse has been annulled, and he is set free. Death has been slain, and we are 
Depart of this life before us who hear and in all the world lie asleep in the Lord. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again we pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, and visitation for the brotherhood of this holy monastery, for the seminary and step faculty, staff, alumni, pilgrims, and benefactors of this holy habitation and their families, and for the pardon and remission of their sins. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Again, we pray for those who bring offerings and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple, for those who labor and those who sing, and for all the people here present who await thy great and rich mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord. Truth, Theotokos, be magnified, be. 
Worthy, O Christ our God, and all glory to Thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of the ages. Amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Most blessed Master, bless. May he who rose from the dead, Christ our true God, through the prayers of his most true mother, and our holy, glorious, and all honorable apostles, of our heavenly patron, Tikhon of Zadok, and, our, and of Tikhon of Moscow, the founder of this holy habitation, of St. James the Confessor, and the venerable Zachariah the Recluse, whose memory we keep this day, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints have mercy on us and save us, for he is good and loves mankind. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. As it shall be in the last time, so it was late on the first day after the Sabbath, when thou dost appear to thy friends, O Christ, passing through closed doors. <clears throat> thou dost announce to them the wonder of wonders, thy resurrection from the dead. Thou dost fill thy disciples with joy and grant them to receive the Holy Spirit, giving them the authority to forgive sins. And thou didst not abandon Thomas when he was threatened by a storm of unbelief. Grant us, therefore, true knowledge and the remission of our sins, O compassionate Lord. Come, let us worship God, our King. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ, our King and our God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King and our God. I will sing of mercy and judgment unto thee, O Lord. I will sing and have understanding in a blameless way. O when wilt thou come unto me in the midst of my house? I have walked in the innocence of my heart. I have set no lawless thing before mine eyes. I have hated the workers of transgression. A perverse heart has not cleaved unto me. The wicked man who turned from me I did not know. Him who speaks secretly against his neighbor have I driven away from me. He who has a proud eye and insatiable heart, with him I have not eaten. Mine eyes are upon the faithful of the land, that they might dwell with me. <clears throat> he that walked in a blameless way, he served me. The proud doer dwelt not in the midst of my house. The speaker of unjust things prospered not before mine eyes. In the morning I slew all the sinners of the land, that I might utterly destroy all the workers of iniquity from the city of the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to thee, O God. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. When the stone had been sealed by the Jews while the soldiers were guarding thy most pure body, thou didst rise on the third day, O Savior, granting life to the world. The powers of heaven therefore cry to thee, O giver of life. Glory to thy resurrection, O Christ. Glory to thy kingdom. Glory to thy dispensation, O thou who lovest mankind. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. We venerate thy most pure image, O good one, and ask forgiveness of our transgressions, O Christ our God. Of thy good will thou wast pleased to ascend the cross in the flesh and deliver thy creatures from the bondage of the enemy. Therefore, with thankfulness, we cry aloud to thee. Thou hast filled all with joy, O our Savior, for thou dost come to save the world. Now endeavor and unto ages of ages, amen. What shall we call thee, O fool of grace? Heaven, for thou dost shine forth the sun of righteousness. Paradise, for thou dost blossom forth the flower of incorruption. Virgin, for thou hast remained uncorrupt. Incorrupt, pure virgin, for thou hast held in thy holy embrace a son who is God of all. Beseech him to save our souls. Order my steps according to thy word, and let no iniquity have dominion over me. Deliver me from the false accusation of men, and so will I keep thy commandments. Make thy face to shine upon thy servant, and teach me thy statutes. Let my mouth be filled with thy praise, O Lord, that I may hymn thy glory and majesty all the day long. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. 
Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. As the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. No one could describe the word of the Father, but when he took flesh from the Theotokos, he accepted to be described and restored the fallen image to its former state by uniting it to divine beauty. We confess and proclaim our salvation in words and images. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord have mercy. Thou art at every season and every hour in heaven and earth art worshipped and glorified, O Christ our God, who art long-suffering, merciful, compassionate, <clears throat> who loves the just and showeth mercy upon the sinner, who calleth all to salvation through the promise of blessings to come. O Lord, in this hour receive our supplications and direct our lives according to thy commandments. Sanctify our souls, hallow our bodies, correct our thoughts, cleanse our minds, deliver us from all tribulation, evil, and distress. Surround us with thy holy angels, that guided and guarded by their host, we may attain to the unity of the faith and to the knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. For blessed art thou unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. More audible than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption thou gavest birth to God the Word. True Theotokos, we magnify thee. In the name of the Lord, most blessed Master, bless. O oh, thou to walk unto us and bless us, shine the light of thy countenance upon us, and have mercy on us. Amen. O oh, Christ, the true light, which illumines all men, sanctify every man who comes into the world. Let the light of thy countenance be signed upon us, that in him we may behold the light unapproachable. God, our footsteps are right to thee, thy keeping of thy commandments, for the intercession of thy all immaculate mother and all thy saints. Amen. O Lord, leader of triumphant hosts, we thy servants delivered from evil, sing our grateful thanks to the O Theotokos, as thou dost possess invincible might set us free from every calamity, so that we may sing, rejoice, O unwed. Have mercy on us, for he is good and loves mankind. Amen. Through the prayer of our most blessed master, O Lord Jesus Christ, have mercy on us. Amen. 